Do you remember The Mighty Ducks? Oh, that was a good film. Well, not a good film, but it had Emilio Estevez in, and it taught you about friendship. What more can you ask, really? And Super Blood Hockey is essentially the game of the film series. It's not affiliated with, or in any way linked with The Mighty Ducks, but it definitely captures all of the best moments from the wonderful game that is ice hockey. It's got goals, goals, and more goals. It's also got its fair amount of misses, misses, stupid misses that you'll kick yourself about for years to come. Or you won't because it's ice hockey and it's not a real sport. No wait, I did just check and it is a real sport. And also, most importantly, it's got fights, which are the heart and soul, the very backbone of ice hockey. But without its fights, ice hockey is just a cold game about kids or fully grown men and women skating on ice, trying to hit a little black lump into a net. Who'd want to watch that? What people come for is for the blood, the glory, the guts. Well, not the guts, they're really tricky to clean up off the floor of the arena. The rink? I don't know what it's called. But anyway, that's what people come for. It's the drama, the tension of seeing two heavily padded individuals just having at it, beating each other over the head, senselessly, with hockey sticks, often over the littlest of things. One guy hit a puck to the left when he should have hit it right. One guy just skated into another man. He didn't mean to, but of course, the other man took umbrage and decided to beat him to a bloody pulp. And it's got all your standards. It's got blocking, it's got skating, and there's some rudimentary aiming with your shots, which is nice, even if the goalkeepers are huge compared to the goals. I mean, it's the same as in normal hockey, so it's, it's being true to the source material, but it just seems unfair, you know? I mean, in football, or for the American viewers, soccer. The goals are huge, and the goalkeepers are in bitty little people. Whereas in ice hockey they seem so large compared to the goal space, it seems almost unfair. You spend all that time skating down there, only to be confronted with what is literally a giant stood in front of a mouse hole. And in this game I've recreated a match between Canada and Russia, which I feel is the political undertones that the Mighty Ducks was always striving towards, but never yet attained. Maybe in the Mighty Ducks 4. Who knows? So if you're a fan of ice skating, ice, blood, and most importantly, ice hockey, then you'll love this game. Go check it out.